I remember she did this. She's like, whoever find me first will get a kiss from me. Oh no, but in game only. Yeah, in game only. <laughs> we met playing Maple Story, and we've been, been dating, dating for, for 12, 12 years. years. But at the, at the point of time, there were a lot of guys who were going after her. Because she has one of the like nicest avatar and then she's like this friendly. Hey, the cash is like one meso, okay, can buy everything. Yeah. And can play dress up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so she was just talking to everyone. Yeah. I I was watching at the side and I just tried to be her friend. So I, I saw her turn down a lot of these guys. And then I remember that turning point was when she revealed her blog. <laughs> no, okay, that time right. I remember the photo I had on my blog, right? It was I had bangs, okay, not like that, but yeah. it's like the... The old school. Yes, and then I had this giant lollipop covering my yeah, face. Yeah. So it was just my eyes, eh. Yeah, yeah. But, but you can see that she's very good looking. She's beautiful. Yeah, so just... <laughs> and then after that, uh, I observed her character in game. Like how she interacts with people. She's very friendly, very nice to be around with. Yeah, that's when I decided to just try. Yeah, it was actually a private server. So at the point of time, I was... There's a reborn system whereby you reach level 200 and then... You, you get, get to restart lah. Restart, yeah. So I was the player with the most reborn. Yeah, he want to show off that he was top on the server. Yeah, and then she yeah, was, the, I was I was new lah. I was new. <laughs> he carried me eh, he carried me. Yeah, carry her, bring her around, do fight all the bosses. So she stayed at the side and you found for her? Yeah, power level. It's called yeah, power, power level. level. So, try power so level. Um, all the private server we played, all the bosses were in the free market, in the rooms. Then what we do for power leveling is that we will have the first character, who's at level 200, fight the monster until like very little health left. Then you rebirth, right? You go to level zero, have someone else kill it for you, then you gain the experience. Mm -hmm. There was a period that he he actually told me when we were playing the private server, that he tried to match my outfit. Like so, but I like to keep changing on like, hey, this one I I feel like wearing this today. So I would keep changing my outfit. Yeah. Then he told me he tried to match but I cannot keep up. <laughs> what else do you do, right? To try and like show her in game. Oh I remember she did this. She's like, whoever find me first will get a kiss from me. Oh no, but in-game only. Yeah, in-game only. It was like, you know, the F3 phase. Yeah. <laughs> then he damn rage when he did it. He wasn't the one who found me. Yeah. Then he just mega and scold the person. <laughs> and then before she became a GM, there was a guy GM there. So for the GM, they have this white colour map, which is the GM room. They took He took her inside to the room. The, I know the GM was trying to woo her at the point of time, yeah. So, very rich, so very I, rich. I just rich from outside. I'm like, I know you GM so what? Just ban me. Yeah. I had to ask her to help me with something with my account. Then at the point of time, that account password has my phone number. So after that, she texts me on my phone number. Yeah, I think to say thank you lah. Cause he after that he he like suddenly drops like oh by the way the number is my phone number. <laughs> then I'm like ah okay then I just drop him a message to say thank you for lending like lending me your account lah. That's that's when the opportunity opens. Easy you change your password to your phone number first. Ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, that no. hmm. I think uh, he asked me to be his girlfriend like uh, the the real girlfriend on Valentine's Day lah. Yeah. So um then I agree oh yeah then there was the whole like. Or oh, just so you know, my relationship is not very long. Yeah. Kind. yeah. So I'm, I'm always going in, into it thinking that, okay, this will maybe just end after two months. <laughs> I think for me on high side, that's a actually very good relationship advice. Because I, you just go into it thinking that, hey, this, this might be the last day that you are with this person. So I just cherish every single day that went by. And then eventually it broke that six months mark. And then <laughs> I, I'm always questioning her, hey, why are we still together? <laughs> I thought it's past six months. Yeah. Yeah. Okay.